Okay. So I got to go back to... Let's refund this one. I don't use it as much. We've got the barricades now, which is the most important thing. Because now we can maze. Let's see. Sangfroid is a bit older. I never played Sangfroid. I'd actually like to. I have consulted the archives. It is as I feared. We are not facing something new, but something very old. Oh, hi. Welcome back. We've just been killing orcs and stuff. No big deal. Okay, so what's the deal with these strange rifts? First, stop this next assault. Then I will tell you the tale. That'll work. Okay, that ain't gonna work. I hope that works. So I gotta use three no matter what to block this off. Oh, hello. Idea. Small fear. Now, if I'm really lucky, they're going to absolutely donk me there, and it's going to be a problem. So it doesn't seem like ceiling tra traps are much of a... are of much worth. I probably should get the, like, blade paths and some other things. Let's see. They'll have to path all the way up there. Oh, part-time. You're right. Balls. I was just trying to be clever and force them to waste a bunch of time, but you're right. I actually really don't want them to be up there. Oh. Well, that's convenient. Okay. Now that's an orc stop. Yeah, how do I want to deal with these guys? Because I, I don't want to overdo it on barricades. They're pretty expensive. Gravity Pillar has unlimited range. Really? Let's do this. I pressed the wrong button. Enemies are preparing to breach one of our gates. They've broken through a gate! Fine. I'll make here it work. Oh no! Whoa! That ogre seems bigger out here in the wild. And remember, if he hits you, he will stun you. Oh yeah! That's how it goes! Okay. The barricade is under attack. So the ogre is a problem. It's dead. Got it. The ogre, ogre is big problem. Okay. Well, okay. this will have to Here do. It's actually a pretty good kill box. More I'll probably want to. Ex way. I'll probably want to expand some things further down. These headshots are absolutely ruining this ogre. Unfortunately, I don't have the best kill corridor, corridor to go after these guys, but that's okay. I'll get what I need where I need it. I just have to hang out. Like, right here. Right here's a decent spot. As, lo 
long as I don't get too close or let them hit me. Mainly barricades getting hit. Ooh, that'll be a problem. Okay, luckily ogres have big heads. Easy for headshots. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's see, so what do I have next? This will catch him off guard. Not a whole heck of a lot. That's the stuff. Should be good. Let's just spread that. Get some early damage up in here. This will catch him off guard. Then maybe some shot traps along the walls. More enemies on the way. Should be good. Hang out on the banister. There we go. Those, those archers are a problem. I guess I could just kind of scoot back and forth. Oh, but I'm going to die in the meantime. Okay. I'm not sure why that was working. Okay. Not so bad. Definitely going to need to build a second kill box up in here, though. I don't see how much. I got plenty. That's the stuff. More enemies on the way. There we go. Should do the trick. Give me a better shot at taking out all the kobolds as we go by. Is under attack. Okay, should solve that problem. I really want the thing that sends things rolling down staircases. I think it was like, uh... That didn't work. Yeah, I should have gone for the shotgun chick. Well, pff, poor Shell would uh, probably not be cool with that, though, if I'm like, I want to be the lady for once. Just had to accept it. There we go. There we go. The barrel launchers and spring traps. Spring traps are pretty good. Ready to roll. More enemies on the way. Yeah, looking good. Okay, so far so good. Probably do a little bit more, have a bunch of like wall traps maybe. They're attacking a barricade. But yeah, I think this is this is a perfectly solid setup. Given what I've got. Is under attack. Decent shooting gallery. Haven't really lost anything. The orc archers are a problem. Not much I can do about that. But I can have plenty of traps, so it's not not that big of a deal. Did I really do that? Eh. It's kind of. Kind of working. All right, there we go. Seriously, this is still going. All right. Uh huh. Deadly. More enemies on the way. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna kind of spread spread death for a little while. That should be good. I'm floored that so many things keep getting past me.
Okay. Hey, they're still getting in there. Definitely need some AoEs up in this. How you doing? Oh, that barricade's doing fine. Like a very light barricade heal would actually probably help tremendously. We're just getting clinked a little bit. So I guess that healing bracer, having that on, on hand, was not actually a terrible... It was not a terrible idea. Alright, now we hang out. Oh, okay, good. It's just a long cooldown item. I hate you. I hate you, Orc Archer. You're very hard to spot from the crowd. Hey, hey, shouldn't have messed with me. One thing I will say, the lighting has gotten so much better in the Orcs Must Die games, it's actually kind of hard to pick enemies out of the crowd. Back in the day, you could just kind of do whatever the heck you want. Uh, and still be able to see almost everything, I think. Could be wrong on that one. Is that fast enough? Yeah, it was fast enough. Give it him skills. I got things to do. Okay, Mega Boom Barrel Launcher. Uh, mountable war scenarios only. That doesn't really sound particularly useful for what I'm doing. There's also the giant flip trap. Also for war scenarios only. Okay, that's a new thing. What else do we have? Giant killer beehive tree. Can be shot or triggers dropping bees. Distracts and damages enemies. No. What I want is something to actually surround in my barricade maze. I know there's the wall grinders, which are actually pretty good. Jar of Ghosts. Rapid Fire Ballista, another war scenario thing. Trap Reset Trinket. That's really good, actually. Heals barricades when active. Oh. Let's see. Auto Ballista Ceiling would be lovely. It would be. Unfortunately, we don't have access to that yet. Yeah, I used to use the grinders a lot. It's not a terrible idea. Okay, let's go back up to Arrow Wall. Refund that, because I'm not going to be using it. We're going to be using the grinder instead. Okay. And Barricade is maxed out. Anything else I want to flick? Uh, grab? I guess there is the flip fl floor trap, but I don't... Eh, I do. I do actually use the flip floor trap decently often in this game. The story of Master Cygnus is known to all. Oh! Master Cygnus taught my hero, Maximilian! Uh, yes, he tried to teach your hero. He was my teacher as well. Didn't you turn evil for- Don't a test me! Sorry, sorceress. What is not known is the story of his best friend, the elf, Vorwick. Human and elf fought side by side, the most talented war mages of the Order. Before infighting forced the Horde into small factions, they used massive traps and defeated the largest orc armies. Cygnus and Vorwick were the best young war mages of their generation. But when their final test came, only one of them would pass. Oh, Cygnus Solo has the Chain Lightning Staff and can feign death. Vorwick in co-op has Elven Short Swords and can teleport. And we also have the Mega Boom Barrel Launcher and the Giant Flip Trap. Interesting. Interesting. 
Here we are once again, friend Vorwick, fighting the largest orc armies ever assembled. I welcome it, friend Cygnus. I am curious about what drives the orcs. You must admit, they are far more willing to die for their cause than our own order mages. They're definitely stubborn, or perhaps just stupid. Perhaps. Nonetheless, their numbers are no match for my strength and your knowledge of rift magic. So what's the side room? Okay, it's a teleporter. Teleporter brings me here. Okay, so they they go here no matter what. And I can just warp through it. A. Well, that's convenient. If I want to... F hmm. Is that worth it? I have a lot of money. We could potentially... We could do some things there. Okay. Very good. Better spot than here. Oh, you actually have to throw people into this. Oh. Well, that's less useful. Let me check the rest of the defenses. So we also have this. Because I have a lot of... I have a lot of money, or at least it feels like a lo lot of money. So, question is, do we want to put them in here? Or, like, here? An excellent location. This should work. I feel like... Hmm. Okay. Tar trap there. Perfection! I feel like this probably isn't going to work. Perhaps one of these. One of these here. Uh, let's see. Okay. I'm just going to do that for the time being. And then what we're probably going to want to do is just kind of repeat the process a little further further in. Like, every single time they go down the stairs. Maybe? I'm not going to be able to make a good... Uh, probably here, actually. Alright. That'll have to do. Alternatively, let's sell these, and let's grab the giant flip traps, er, giant flip traps, 
giant flip traps. Oh, shift one and two. Okay, so I have them no matter what. All right, in that case, I'm going to grab just enough money. I'm a little afraid of using the giant flip trap there. But here's the thing. I really should fill this thing out with the maximum number of giant flip traps. Yeah. Uh, let's go get a little bit more money in that case. I'll just pull from my, like, back line. My main thoughts are, that's going to do more damage than I think anything else. I'll even pull that one. Alright, there we go. So ho hopefully this will just wipe out the vast meat of them before they even get close to me. And if they don't, with force. so be it. They'll still do horrible things to their whole group. Okay, let's get yes, going. I am prepared. Now let's see how many dudes are coming my direction, because I can only imagine it's an egregious amount. Oh, this is a decent number of orcs. I wonder if there's a way to do this mission trapless. It's probably impossible. You'd have to, like, get headshots on everything. I mean, I'm doing a decent amount of damage to them. I'm low on mana. Yeah, and I'm not getting more mana back. There's none there for this, for sure. Yeah, chain lightning, chain lightning leaves a little bit to be desired. Maybe with the mana trinket. to breach one of our gates. I am near ah, heavy orcs. This should be fun. Do not take them for granted. They are a bit meaner than their smaller counterparts. Okay. Look out! Our enemies are attacking! Yeah, they're gonna break the gate. They've broken through a gate! Actually, just gonna... I should probably seed a bunch of dart traps all over the place. You know who's a complete moron and didn't actually lock this side off? Somebody saw this. Somebody saw this coming. Oh, I'm so boned. <laughs> Tried to tell you. Look, I considered it, I thought about it, I forgot to do it, and... Here we are once again, friend Vorwick, fighting the largest orc armies ever assembled. I welcome it, friend Cygnus. I am curious about what drives the orcs. You must admit, they are far more willing to die for their cause than our own order mages. They're definitely stubborn, or perhaps just stupid. Perhaps. Nonetheless, their numbers are no match for my strength and... Your knowledge of rift magic. Okay, so this does not count as inside. All right. Well, this time, not making the same mistake. Here's where they will fall. Perfection. Let's see. I'll be a little space efficient for at least this section. An excellent location. Very good. Okay, let's get over here. Let's see, isn't there another small other side path they can get through? Nope. They won't go through that that cut through. Alright. Let's begin. Unleash the horde. 
This time, I'm not going to screw myself over by forgetting to barricade certain things. But yeah, that elf is, uh, super clearly evil. Unsurprisingly. Whereas Cygnus, on the other hand, seems kind of dumb. Admittedly, I haven't- I don't know if I ever played Orcs Must Die 1. So I don't remember the story from it in the slightest. I know the, uh, the sorceress was the villain in the first one, but that was all I know. Well... Definitely doing less good against these guys now, but is what it is. Oh. Yeah, the chain lightning only chains chains to like one or two other orcs, and it's like, oh, that's that's less cool. <laughs> Ow! How dare you! Oh right, I can I can charge it up. Ow. Heavy orcs. This should be fun. Do not okay. take them for granted. They are a bit meaner than their smaller counterparts. Yeah, so it's actually- oh, I see, the mana cost is- The mana cost is actually taken in the very beginning. I don't really have much that works against ogres. Perfect. Look out! Our enemies are attacking! That should work. The enemy army is attacking! I didn't think about making the gate considerably harder to bust up. I didn't put my barricades down the best. But, like, that's a very good delaying tactic that we're probably going to have to tear up fairly quickly. I am not hitting a single one of these guys. Enemy forces are attacking! They've broken through a gate! Barricade is under attack! Would you please stop? Oh, because I didn't give him space to get through. There absolutely is space to get through, you jerk. They're attacking a barricade. A vile creature, dead. Why would you do that? Okay, well, that actually worked out better than I thought it was going to. Uh, it could have worked out a little bit better, but still. Oh, ceiling overhang prevents ogres. <laughs> Jerks. Here. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to slower delay them like I did previously. Perhaps one of these. Well, that's not necessarily so bad. All right. Waves two out of five. Holy shit, these are long. This is long. More enemies on the way. Oh, this will stop the ogres. Well, it's fine. I actually don't need that there anyway.
It's okay. We'll be fine. Wow, that didn't hit anybody. Might not be the best place for me to hang out. Okay. This should be better. Maybe I should have actually gotten that ballista after all. Uh, you know what? Let's let's get it for the next one. And put it on that platform segment and see if I can actually shoot at them from afar. I'll admit, that's pretty satisfying. That's pretty dang satisfying. Okay. Ogres are the ones that I have to worry about. Everything else I can just kind of MasterCard my way through. Excuse me. I need these I need these funds. Is that a free skull? Hey! I like it when games give that sort of thing to me. Okay, got anything else? No. A lot of people getting flipped. That's not so bad. Yeah, do we see how many enemies we have? I will admit, I'm really digging the war modes for, like, massive amounts of enemies. Hopefully we get some more, uh, wild, like, giant war traps. Also, I think for this one I should have actually gone for the, uh, the arrow traps. With, like, a pierce. Okay, if I can actually manage to headshot the ogres, they ain't, they ain't biscuits. It actually looks like the the ogres will just go for my barricades no matter what. Or, oh, I see. They're just automatically stuck because they can't find a path. So they don't try and clear the shortest path. They just try and clear a path. Or maybe, I guess that is the shortest path. I understand. Won't be the last. Okay. It's fine. We got we got the ogre situation fairly handled. We just have to uh, run circles around them for a little bit, and then I'll make a better better path for it. Cause yeah, I don't remember the ogres being this big. Or this easy to get stuck. Not sorry to see that one gone. Yeah, so I have to like aim really oh, high for the hit already. hitbox on that. Alright, whatever. Uh let's see. So let's sell that trap. Well, I guess I'll just put that that in there for the time being.